Welcome to Strange Historical Tales. Today, we discuss the top five most bizarre unsolved crimes in history. Coming in at number five is the Axeman of New Orleans. The Axeman of New Orleans was a serial killer active in New Orleans and surrounding communities from May 1918 to October 1919. The killer targeted primarily Italian-American grocers and their families, typically attacking them with an axe that often belonged to the victims themselves. In many cases, the murderer broke into homes by chiseling out a panel of a door, which allowed him to reach inside and unlock the door. The most infamous aspect of the axe man's case is the letter he allegedly sent to local newspapers in March 1919 in which he claimed to be a supernatural being who loved jazz music and promised to spare anyone whose home was playing jazz music on a specific night. That evening, the city was filled with the sound of jazz as residents hosted parties in fear of the axe man's wrath. Despite several theories and numerous suspects, including the potential mob connection, the Axeman's identity remains unknown and the killings abruptly stopped in October 1919, leaving the city to wonder who was the Axeman and why did he kill. Coming in at number four is the Isdal Woman. The Isdal Woman refers to the unidentified woman whose charred body was found in the Isdalen Valley in Bergen, Norway on November 29, 1970. The circumstances surrounding her death are shrouded in mystery. Investigators discovered that all the labels on her clothing had been removed and she carried multiple passports with different identities, suggesting she may have been involved in espionage. Near her body, items such as a burned passport, empty liquor bottles, and sleeping pills were found, further complicating the investigation. Despite extensive efforts by Norwegian police and international authorities, her true identity and the cause of her death remain unknown. Over the years, theories have emerged suggesting she might have been a spy during the Cold War, with some linking her to various intelligence activities. The case continues to intrigue and baffle investigators and has become one of Norway's most enduring mysteries. Taking the number three spot is the Hinterkaifeck Murders. The Hinterkaifeck Murders took place on a remote farmstead in Bavaria, Germany, on the night of March 31, 1922. The victims included Andreas Gruber, his wife, Kazilia, their widowed daughter, Victoria Gabriel, and Victoria's two children, along with the family maid who had only recently been hired. What makes this case particularly chilling is the series of strange events leading up to the murders. Andreas Gruber had reported hearing footsteps in the snow leading to the house, but none leading away, and the family had found a mysterious newspaper in their home that none of them had purchased. On the night of the murders, the entire family was lured one by one into the barn where they were killed with a mattock. The killer then moved inside the house to murder the maid and the youngest child. In the days following the murders, neighbors reported seeing smoke coming from the chimney and food from the pantry had been eaten, suggesting the killer stayed in the house for days before leaving the scene. Despite various suspects being investigated, including potential family members and local villagers, the case was never solved, and it remains one of Germany's most infamous unsolved cases. Coming in at number two is the Black Dahlia. The Black Dahlia case refers to the murder of Elizabeth Short, whose mutilated body was discovered in a vacant lot in Los Angeles on January 15, 1947. Elizabeth, an aspiring actress, was found cut in half at the waist with her body drained of blood and her face grotesquely slashed from the corners of her mouth to her ears, creating a Glasgow smile. The brutality of the crime and the mystery surrounding her death quickly captivated the nation, with newspapers giving Elizabeth the posthumous nickname Black Dahlia. The investigation became one of the largest in Los Angeles history, with police interviewing hundreds of suspects, but no one was ever charged. 
numerous theories have surfaced over the years, including connections to Hollywood, the mob, and even corrupt officials, but the true identity of the killer remains a mystery. The case has inspired countless books, films, and even conspiracy theories, cementing its place in American pop culture. And taking the number one spot is the Zodiac Killer. The Zodiac Killer is the pseudonym of an unidentified serial killer who operated in Northern California from the late 1960s to the early 1970s. The Zodiac is confirmed to have killed at least five people, though he claimed in letters to have murdered as many as 37. The killer was known for sending taunting letters and cryptograms to local newspapers, some of which included ciphers that remain unsolved to this day. The Zodiac's victims included young couples and a lone cab driver, and the killing seemed to be motivated more by a desire for notoriety than any clear pattern. Despite extensive investigations and a few close calls, such as a surviving victim who provided a description of the killer, the Zodiac was never caught. The case remains open and the killer's identity continues to be a subject of speculation with theories ranging from the involvement of a single individual to a possible conspiracy involving multiple perpetrators. The Zodiac Killer case has become one of the most famous unsolved serial killer cases in the world, inspiring numerous books, films, and other works of fiction. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of Strange Historical Tales. If you enjoyed this content, please like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next episode.